a $300 million super yacht, a multi-million dollar estate in Hawaii, and a $450 million private jet fleet. These are stupidly expensive things. Mark Zuckerberg owns. The story of its creation by founder Mark Zuckerberg has become almost mythological. And we gotta start with Mark's ultimate flex. Because back in 2011, Mark invested around seven million in a modest yet elegant residence in Palo Alto. This 6,000 square foot home boasts a salt water pool, a spacious garden, and a home theater. But that's just the beginning. In 2012, Zuckerberg bought four neighboring properties for about $43.8 million to create a private compound for his family. Each of these homes underwent extensive renovations to suit his tastes and needs. As this wasn't enough for him, in 2013, he purchased a townhouse in San Francisco's Mission District for $10 million. The 7,000-square-foot home has undergone significant renovations, including a new kitchen, bathroom, office space, wine room, and a basement-level garage that included a turntable for the cars so they could get out more easily. However, Mark recently sold it for $31 million. Even though he already spent more than $50 million, Mark also bought a stunning 750-acre estate in Kauai, Hawaii, for which he shelled out $100 million in 2014. This expansive property includes a working organic farm and spans pristine beaches and lush landscapes, providing a serene getaway from Silicon Valley's hustle and bustle. Incredibly, Mark began raising cows at this estate, spending between $180,000 and $360,000 a year on food for each cow. But hey, that's nothing to a billionaire like Mark. Although his net worth is worth billions, he leads a relatively modest lifestyle compared to his peers, as shown in some of the cars he owns. Zuckerberg is the proud owner of a Honda Fit, worth approximately $16,000. He also has a couple of Acura TSX sedans, each valued at about $30,000. Showing his practical side and for a more eco-friendly ride, Mark drives a Volkswagen Golf GTI priced at around $30,000. Yeah, Mark is a humble guy, but the next car he owns is not a cheap one, for sure. Back in 2014, when he was only 30 years old, Zuckerberg decided to buy a Pagani Huayra, which cost him around $3 million. This Italian hypercar is known for its exquisite craftsmanship and blistering speed. But he's not stopping there. Mark also possesses an impressive fleet of private jets for his extensive travels. He owns several aircraft, including the Gulfstream G650, valued at around $65 million. This jet is known for its long-range capabilities and luxurious interiors accommodating up to 19 passengers comfortably. In addition to the Gulfstream G650, Zuckerberg also charters various jets to ensure the utmost privacy and security for his travels. In fact, in 2022, his company Meta spent $6.6 .6 million in private jet expenses on his CEO Mark and Sheryl Sandberg. His total investment in private aviation is estimated to exceed $450 million over the years, including operational and maintenance costs. But look, this wasn't the only time Mr. Zuckerberg spent a multi-million dollar bag on himself. Back in 2007, he entered the yacht industry by acquiring a super yacht named Ulysses for a staggering $150 million. This 107-meter vessel was previously owned by a New Zealand billionaire. It features multiple decks, a helipad, a swimming pool, and luxurious accommodations for up to 36 guests and crew. However, he also appears to be the proud owner of an even more expensive yacht, the Super Yacht Launch Pad. This 118-meter super yacht was initially built for a Russian oligarch. It can house dozens of guests and boasts an expansive gym, a spa, a movie room, a swimming pool, and a helipad. Although it remains unknown what's the name under the yacht, sources suggest Mark acquired this spectacular super yacht for his 40 years old birthday for a staggering sum of $300 million. When Mark blows a bag, he goes hard. 
I mean, the dude even used his billionaire net worth as an opportunity to flex. The expenses incurred to safeguard Mark Zuckerberg, one of the wealthiest and most influential tech personalities, significantly surpassed those of his peers. In 2021, Meta Platforms allocated over $15 million towards ensuring the security of its CEO, both at his residence and during his travels, as reported by Bloomberg. This exorbitant amount spent on protecting Zuckerberg does not account for the additional $10 million designated as a pre-tax allowance for his family's security measures. Now, that is a big money move. But Zuckerberg has made even bigger investments because he spent millions of dollars making philanthropy history. In 2017, Mark Zuckerberg announced his intention to sell 35 to 75 million shares within the next 18 months to support the Chan Zuckerberg Initiative, aiming to raise between $6 billion and $12 billion. The Chan Zuckerberg Initiative, established by Zuckerberg and his wife in 2015, focuses on personalized learning, disease eradication, community building, and fostering connections. Over the years, CZI has provided grants totaling nearly $3 billion. This dude even joined Bill Gates alongside Warren Buffett and other prominent figures and has pledged to donate the majority of his wealth to philanthropy. He intends to liquidate 99% of his Facebook shares within his lifetime. But see, there's another thing Mark loves. Katanas. Not long ago, he was seen crafting a katana, a traditional Japanese weapon, next to the master Akihira Kokaji. This weapon is worth more than $25,000. Well, look, man. Don't let him fool you because even though Mark's a nice guy, if you make him angry, he'll snap. And that's exactly what almost happened in 2005. During Facebook's origins, Kagan, an ex-employee, said Zuckerberg had a stint where he carried a katana to threaten employees who did a poor job on a product. Fortunately, no employees were injured while they were there, according to Kagan, who worked for nine months at Facebook in 2005. Man, I know you want to know more about billionaires, so just click this video right here. Just click it.